Hello there everyone, and welcome back to Napoleon Total War 3 with not the Spanish campaign. Instead, we have a drop-in battle, but as you can tell, I'm playing as the British, so I'm dropping actually in to someone else campaign. You can actually see over on the playlist here, Herr Lindstrom. I'm dropping into his Spanish campaign. He's playing the 1805 campaign, and he's playing a Spain invading Great Britain. So we're actually right now in the Battle of Scot... Uh, I was about to say Battle of Scotland, but basically uh, the Battle of Glasgow, where uh, I believe he said he's going to bring 80% of all the land forces he has in this entire campaign it's being brought to bear to try and reclaim Scotland. He's already taken it once and made it his protectorate and then the British came and took it back and so now the second time and so we're looking at quite the big battle I believe he said earlier that there's going to be 16,000 Spanish troops at against 10,000 British we'll see how this goes as soon as I click ready we're off and yes let's just go ahead and do that uh, we'll see how long this goes on before it crashes or whatever. So if there's no end screen battle as I usually do, that's probably because it crashed. Well, you'll pr I'll probably pl leave that part in just to uh, clarify that. Enough talking though. We want some raiding to do. So let's go ahead and see how this goes. So it's going to tick down here and then we're ready. Now, I imagine... Well, the Spanish going to have a lot of guerrillas in these tree lines. And since I am, I believe, actually defending, we're going to try and hold this kind of pig pen or animal, you know, corral, whatever you want to call it. That's going to be our main. And then we're going to see um, some of the units you will notice, especially on my side, might have weird looking... Uh, okay, so, uh, yeah, they've got some strange um, textures. Yeah, whatever. I'll just not zoom in on those guys. Take a closer look at those. Um, I'm not sure if I should actually be pushing out to take the woods or not. I'm thinking I won't. And we will try and just hold the pig pen, as I call it. Right. So we can see some troops already. We've got some Triadors. He's got his cannons. Some 9 pounders, 12 pounders moving up here. Definitely a focus on my attack right off the start. Foot guards. Oh, lots of foot guards. Nasty troops. I was thinking maybe I should just charge some of my cavalry right in there just to get rid of those that cavalry but I'm not sure that would go too well we'll just make sure that we focus our artillery blasts there to start off try and kill those I wonder though how well how useful that actually is it might be better for me to actually target oh we hit and destroyed one of their guns. Nice. I am think I'm going to focus in on the foot guards, actually. For now, we're going to hold position. I'm thinking he's probably going to have tons of light troops. Now, luckily for me, I've got quite a bit of cavalry on either flank. And I've played one, pot one, which is light dragoon Scots, right in the center. We've got a little bit of mix in terms of troops. Brunswick troops. King's German Legion. Just a regiment of foot, regiment of foot. Okay, so he's moving in. Nice start there by taking out one of his 12 pounders. I'm sure he's going to actually target the cavalry right off the bat. Might continue to blast those cannons actually and see if we can get them to leave. He set up his 9 pounders. Let's make sure that everyone's targeting the same. Yeah, I definitely don't have the troops right now. The infantry... Ooh, okay, so he's got lots of cavalry moving on the flank there. Let's go ahead and set up a little bit better positions. 
in terms of taking a little bit more of a defensive stance. I think we'll put two and then one in reserve. We can push you a little bit back. And then we can have you there with retreating towards the uh, the walls. I was thinking I was going to entrench that cannon because I had the option. But I'm not too sure about that. We're really focusing in on that. Okay, so we got Dragoons. He's definitely, yeah, he's spotted all of this cavalry. He's definitely got the stronger cavalry on that side. I'm... That's a weird formation. I'm actually going to pull my cavalry back. Try and uh, maybe get some help for my infantry. Maybe not the greatest idea to get surrounded. I haven't spotted anything here. Which makes me a little bit concerned. I should... Actually send this Light Dragoon unit off... To the side. And take a look and see if I cannot... Actually find... What his cavalry's got there. Because he's, he's definitely got... He definitely put up a lot of cavalry over here. Continuously blasting these guys. But I do think I want to actually get my cannons to blast his cavalry, I think. Is really what I want to blast away. Uh, we're deaf. I'm not sure we're dealing that much damage to them. But we're definitely unsettling that gun. Killing the crew won't do. We need to kill the actual cannon. Wow. Um, I don't really have... The, I mean, the composition is not the best. The thing is, he said that I was going to get even more cavalry as reinforcement. What I might do, just to get some of the reinforcements going, and just kind of upsetting his plans is by going for a heavy strike onto this side and sending so oh, okay now we can see some of the cavalry and uh, yeah it's even worse than on the other side here they had dragoons on this side I can see something with oh crap it's the Kraziers it's even worse at least I'm dealing a lot of damage to that cannon what I want to do is I want to drag these guys in to the point where they kind of charge in against these guys. On their own, they're not going to win the fight. But if they get support by um, infantry, then they might be able to hold. And it's this unit right here that I want to bring back. My formation looks awful. It looks like I'm, you know noob square camping but I want to be cautious yeah he's moving over more cavalry over to that side can I when they're just out of reach are they mm. I can actually fire some of these shots on to his troops do it does he have any weaker troops is lot he's about to come into fighting range here actually soon enough you will now be set to canister the walls there are actually really awkwardly set up got two generals so plenty of generals to lose gone All right. they're gonna come into battle here soon enough I have lost quite a few troops here. Um, oh, he's uh, aiming his cannon through the... Uh, how nice of him. He tells me where he's tr hitting the troops over there. I have plenty of generals, I'll tell you. You know what? Let's 
throw him a curveball. Yeah, he's coming close now. Let's throw him a curveball. By having cavalry going for the. Um, I'm gonna send three units of cavalry down the center, th right through the middle of my line, as we start to exchange musket fire here. We're starting to uh, fire canister. Soften up the center, will you? Go on. Alright. Alright, we've got musket fire going off. I want to see if I can unsettle some of his troops. I'm going to concentrate on that one right there. Concentrate everything, damn you! Alright. We're trading a bit of fire. Actually, might just have this Light Dragoon go ahead and strike these light troops, which are coming really close. What I want to do is unsettle this bit. Let's see, this might go terribly wrong or terribly well. Alright, my cavalry is going through. I'm ordering a charge. Alright, we broke some troops over here. I'm gonna focus Our in. Men are running for okay, the cavalry, yeah, that did not work at all. It's kind of working over here a little bit. I'm gonna pull my troops back. Oh, this is a whole nother ball game, isn't it? Alright, well, we're focusing over here. I'm gonna send a little troop over there. Rally the troops. Alright, let's go after them. Oh yeah, I managed to punch through. I'm gonna ride up the rear. What my target is, is to force as many of these into square as possible. Possibly hitting this one. Oh. Your attack is not gonna work out, is it? Reaffirm it. Oh, look at that. This one's doing really poorly for some reason. Why could that be? And as this little unit now comes up behind, I want to strike him. And we're going to punch punch through. His uh, heavy cavalry is setting up. Oh, we broke it. We broke it. We broke the center. What a lovely day. What's going on here? Spanish attack. We've broken off two units. General move back. Um, we're about to break there, actually. You should move back. Oh, what's going on? God save his majesty. I just broke the cavalry. We kind of broke through the center. I want to move my ca cannons over here. Can you switch to canister, please? Our men are running. Don't mind if I do, sir. Now turn it on them. Now get canister over here. Everyone's routing everywhere. Now I've got the troops back here. Actually drop the squares. Move information. Now I want to make sure that none of these come back. But actually it's more important to get rid of all this uh, blasted... Um, well, he's blasted infantry. Okay, so we've got a charge coming in here. God awful timing for me to be forced into square, but there you go. He thought he had me, did he? Oh, he's coming around here for another attack. Oh, and my troops here are unfortunately stuck. 
I will order them to attack. I'll bring my general closer to support. And now my cavalry is coming up the rear. I'm sure their cavalry is going to come back at some point. I'm sure also my cavalry is super tired at this point. Oh, we got massive break over on this side. The line fell apart. We can't have everything, can you? Alright, back on the guns, you lazy bastards. Oh, this, unfortunately, there's not a lot of, like... Like, I'm not close to the action. Watching much of it. So, you'll have to um, excuse me for that. But we've got kind of a major thing going on here. Can you maybe get a shot off there? Victory, is soon to be yours. victory. We're supposed to get reinforcements. Right, rally. Rally, you sons of dogs. Right. My cavalry performed better than I thought. Get rid of uh, the cannons if you can. Right, we're trying to organize. The cannons were gone over there. Right. The Spaniards are charging. Oh yeah, I remember now these hats right here. I definitely remember them. We've got a bloody shootout over here. Right, forward. I want to be shooting at that square by as soon as possible. Right. It turned into a suicide match. Where it seemed that everything kind of fell apart. What a lot of things fell apart. Cannons back in action. My troops get got rid of those. Our men are running, sir. No, don't attack that, actually. Let's see if we can't get a little bit organized. I want you to fire a canister. You're not in a good position and you're about to get overrun by enemy cavalry. Don't fire a canister anymore. The enemy is all around us. squares as you please. I'm sure he's rallied cavalry. I'm getting so many generals. I'm getting an additional two generals. Where is my map? Okay, so they're coming from over there. I'm not too concerned with them. Form square, uh, there's a large contingent of enemy cavalry assaulting us. Uh, you might want to get back in order. He's uh, getting his line back together. What a mess! What a mess everything turned into. Why am I getting generals? I definitely... I already have two generals. Why do I need two more? Right. The Spanish are making sure that a lot of my units are get, getting destroyed. In the process. This was a very interesting battle. And the thing is, since it's not my campaign, I don't really care how it goes, do I? <laughs> but it seems to be a slaughter. And I'm just wasting the cavalry. The entire unit is dead, sir. Ooh, the entire unit. That sounds bad. I form into square. We do have cannons over here. I've set them to canister. Might actually switch to round shot so they do fire a bit. I'm gonna get this um, horse drawn artillery piece and we're gonna set it up over there. I've got so many generals here. Half my army is just generals. Oh, this is not a general, this is the cannon crew. But right now, I've got, let's see, I've got five generals. 
I've definitely got enough to spare. You know what? We're gonna send these two. Actually, everyone that doesn't have a proper face. Please leave the field. And you. Or maybe I should send this guy away because I've already wasted a bunch of his stars or a bunch of his abilities. So let's waste their abilities before we send them away, actually. So I'll just have. I'll just contend with four generals for now. Right, it was an absolute disaster in terms of everything. But I'm still on the field. I mean, the micromanagement, but the thing is, I thought I was doomed, right? Surrounded on all sides. We'll get all... I'm ordering all the generals to rendezvous in this wood. And then we're getting two additional cavalry units to come in here. I'm thinking he's actually got... he's got all his cavalry on this side. My reinforcements cavalry is coming this side. I'll have them ride up this side and strike him. There's no way he's going to be able to get through the squares. So I'll just organize a bunch of squares on this. And then we'll prepare a flanking maneuver around his left. There's no point in having you in the center. I'm going to march you down. Get you around town. There's no point as well at shooting at those. I want to shoot at the units. It's gonna hurt. Well, what's he doing here? Going after my generals like I don't have any to spare. Very tired. Why don't you face my light dragoons, will you? Definitely need to get rid of some of these generals. We've got plenty of them. Right, so we're gonna have a. Uh, I mean, he can definitely charge with all his cavalry if he wants. But I've got plenty of squares to hide behind. Now he does have a cavalry situated behind there. And I don't really know what he's got. Can we get the um, howitzers to focus in on that? Oh, he's coming closer now. What is his cavalry doing? Skirting around. Coming towards my cavalry, are they? I wonder if he, if he, uh, he spots my uh, idea here. It's actually probably better for me to actually strike his cavalry. Because they've been dragged in behind my lines. Even if he sends his infantry forward now, it's too late for them to actually do anything good. He's been tearing up the Brunswick. Sir, your general has been killed. Oh no, one this of my generals. It's not like I've got five, sixty, seven thousand of them to spare. Okay, he's moving them back. Kind of a disarray. Oh. Missed that unit. And comes another one in reinforced. Oh no! Spanish cavalry! Surrounded. My reinforcement troop is not doing well though. Do I have any generals to that I can throw into this? Our men are running, sir. We broke that one. As long as this one holds, I'm pretty sure I'll be able to break the main of the Spanish cavalry. I'll just throw in a few generals for good measure. Yeah, keep turning the Spanish cavalry around. Massive cavalry fight behind my position.
He probably would have been better off actually pushing his infantry for another attack. But then again, I there's they have been they have been losing a lot of manpower, have they not? Well, there goes the Spanish cavalry. Right. Get yourself organized. Everyone's tired at this point. Let's see. Can I get my generals in order? Right. Generals. There's no point in us being in squares anymore. Because there's no enemy cavalry behind us. So we're going to drop the squares and move into lines. And we're going to get in positions. Now, it looks like his infantry is still getting, uh, or his reinforcement is still coming from over there. We're going to. Why is the. so hard to organize the cavalry? Like, when I take three of these, look at what they want, want me to send them. I'm just going to put everyone in a pile there. Which is going to be a great target for artillery, well, now when I think about it. But I only think he has two guns left. His entire army seems to be on the move now. Uh, focus in on that mob. Actually, you should be focusing in on that. So I don't know if he's going to move everyone kind of in a step towards where he's getting his reinforcements. Or if he... Um, God knows what he's planning. He might, he, might be, uh, he might be pulling out of this. Re-establishing around this, woods in, this wood instead. As his reinforcements coming down this road. I wonder at this point how many troops have actually died on the field or just retreated or what has really happened here. It would be rather clever of him to uh, reposition there. I've got pretty good position to fire up the uh, sides of these units as they march in front of me. He's setting up with his... Uh, he's got some cannons and stuff coming in. Or is he, perhaps, looking to bait my cavalry into an attack over there? Like he's pur purposefully moving everything, not necessarily trying to avoid... I'm going to spread out my generals all along the line here. We've lost one. still have four. I'm sure I'm going to get even more. Ooh, here we get a pretty heavy cavalry unit. We get another Hussar. And then heavy Dragoons. It's going to be moved in on the left. Uh, what I want to do is I want to move in and I want to destroy his infantry. Okay, so my little cavalry unit over here, the Light Dragoons, have been able to skirt his position without finding any opposition. I'm sure there's going to be a little guerrilla unit somewhere in there. He's moving one unit to deal with this. I wonder if he's not... If he's moving... If he has to move a cavalry unit all the way over here to try and deal with this, then I don't think he actually got anything here. Which is... Ooh, look at that. Brunswick Hussars. That's all that's going to be moved over there. I'm going to move all my cavalry. We're going to have to leave one unit of infantry and this one but I'm gonna take the three units of infantry that I do still have 
they're gonna be moved forward into an attack together with all the cavalry that you can see right now moving into position so when he's forced to move into square I'll have infantry ready for him oh, he's gonna move his infantry he's gonna move them back I'm gonna get rid of your 12 pounder sir right, now keep moving back here I'm not sure this one is very useful in whatever it's doing. Gonna tell it to hold fire, and then we're gonna get a U3 to move out there. You're gonna get the current foremost general. Okay, so you're coming out here. What is your plan? We're gonna turn the gun on its side. We're gonna fire some canister. He might be going after this gun, I don't know. I turned it too much, I think. Oh, we're gonna be able to fire just in time, it seems. Perfect! More canister going after you. Right. There's no point in chasing after that. Our men are running, oh. sir. The two cavalry units fought each other and they destroyed each other. Alright, so he took out that gun over there. Back to fire an explosive. He's bringing his troops tighter together. I wish I got some more infantry. We do have a pretty uh, heavy cavalry unit coming in. I wish I got more infantry. Is he moving? He's moving forward now. He's. Uh, he feels confident with his uh, the troops he has at hand. I'm gonna send all my uh, all my troops forward. He's moving more troops in. Right, cavalry units move in. You will be left to guard. You will drop your square. You will set up. Right there. You can blast canister that way. I want you to fire against the center. Cavalry is kind of messed up into each other. What does he have here? Okay, the fight has started over here. I'm ordering canister shots that way. Oh, he's moving back. Let's see what he thinks of this. An envelopment! His troops are formed square. And his main line has uh, splintered. Sending my cavalry after the only unit that didn't have time to form square. My line advances, even though the enemy's got more troops, infantry at hand. The British lines will advance. I right, hold the line. I need something to support this cavalry unit. Go after the cannons, will Our you? men are running, sir. Right, unfortunately, they broke. The line is holding. 
My cavalry is doing their job. I'm sending this cavalry around. This square might very well break soon. We've got shots bursting in the air above the Spanish lines. Right, hold fire. I want the entire line to fire, goddammit. Okay, they're dropping. They're dropping their square just to pull back. This square is about to fall. Go on, running. kill that Spanish unit over there. We have a charge coming in. The fourth foot guard is broken. Right, keep harassing that unit. Can I get some explosive shots going in on that one? God save the queen, or king. I guess it's the king at this point. He's sending his general over to support that. We broke this square. So I have the British Dragoons. Now they're very tired, but they'll still be able to move into position. We've got cannons and infantry moving in hard to uh, deal some damage to me. I'm gonna get my cavalry around. Oh, we won! Hurry back to the fight. You're not supposed to run your troops like this, but... Yeah, he keeps going back to... Yeah, he keeps being forced back into square. The goons continue around. Unfortunately for you, sir, I still have plenty of... Tr I have... Well, not plenty, I wouldn't say... Oh, We're getting cannons! still have my hussars, and I've got plenty of generals in the area. We're surrounding his force over here. Oh, he's gotten into my flank. He's gotten into the flank of the Brunswicks. My Brunswick drop. We're continuously shelling these guys right here. Active? Ooh, active? Say what? I will advance. We know no fair. Alright, let's always move back a bit. Okay, one cavalry broke immediately, the other one broke immediately as well. But I can always trust the dragoons. Are you dead? That's why I can't use you. And charge the square. Good shots. And always trust the dragoons. Difficult fighting. Oh, he's calling in a charge. Oh, the square broke just in time. Oh, the line broke. I thought I ordered you to form into square. Brunswickans will pull off. Can I charge you in, maybe? If nothing more than to throw you into the fight. Oh, they're shooting at my hussars, are they? Our men are running, sir. I've got extra cannons coming in. Oh, they're fighting the general. No matter. Oh, here comes uh, here comes cavalry. 
one of my cavalry units has rallied. Right, my uh, attack here didn't work out. But I unsettled him a bit. Oh, he's preparing, is he? Alright. Oh, and he's building up the pretty good cannon position. Let's keep blasting it. Oh, I've got a scout unit scouting his reinforcements. Alright. Oh, I, the two cavalry units actually. Still in there. Still fighting, eh? Okay, they're gonna um, try and leave and get rally with the rest of them. Let's see, my cannon's coming in. We'll set up new cannon positions. Oh, finally, infantry! Infantry to be moved in. I will hound you, sir. I will hound you. You're not getting away. You might have won that battle. I can't move this cannon, unfortunately. Should move a general close to support. Should have had a general close to all times. Right, they're uh, closing in. Right, one unit got broken down. Not gonna get let the Irish get out of this. I'm sure the cavalry will rally once more. Yep, he's moving to square. Pull off. But we got units within musket range. So I'll be able to do a little bit of supporting. We'll do a little bit of trolling. Oh, he's going after that guy over there. Right, pull off again. And then the rest of you close in. Maybe you can help out over there. Cannon is now in position. You'll set up next to that. Let's go back over here. Right, you're pulling off. Oh, you're moving up the perfect angle as well. Right at the corner there. I right, hold. See if you want to make it back here. There's no way I'm letting the Irish escape. And uh, yeah, they're starting to lose quite a bit. You will make it over here. Because if you make it there, you can make it anywhere. Right, make sure they don't come back. And then we'll rally all the small units. And the general. I wish I could move the... They should be able to just... There's enough people to push the guns around. Right. Get in there. I don't want to see those guys again. Ah, oh, it's the dra Dragoons! Obviously, I can always trust the Dragoons. They're a really powerful unit. They've come back time and time again. Yeah, we don't need to pester the Irish anymore. They're not going to come back. Is my guns even firing? No, they aren't, because I have to give them like a fire like that. Yeah. 
Let's have the, all the cavalry move back. A well deserved chevron for the ninth horse guard. These units terrible in everything. Break at a moment's notice. Right, so suddenly I've only got two generals and I realize Maybe I should have saved some of those five that I started off with. It's going to take forever to get the uh, the units into play. Um, you will at some point get the cold stream guard. Damn. It's almost like he can hear me. He, he knows that I want the infantry. Now he does have the cannons. And is able to blast me, however. I am the defender in this battle. You'll have to dislodge me at some point or another. Right, his cavalry's moving up there. Can fire a few round shots that way. I'm guessing the cold stream is going to be one of the last units I get. He's got three units here. He might have something hidden here. But he seems to have been moving more and more troops over to this side. But as my reinforcements coming in this side, this is where I'm looking to fight him. We're going to have the cavalry. Or at least one of the units of cavalry that I have left. Move to that side. I'm not sure the Brunswickers are that good. They might look fearsome. But I'm not sure they're all that good. King's German Legion is our. And then we got the Horse Guard. Oh, he's moved his units. It's going to be hard to keep a track on that, so I'm just going to tell the cannons to fire into the middle of all the cannons over there. Right, he's definitely moving troops to deal with the fact that I'm moving hussars into the flank. And what do we have here? First, Yorkshire, West Riding. It's going to move into play. So I've got three regiments coming in. Three regiments of foot. Actually, what I should do is I should actually tell these small ones to leave the battlefield. And so I can get new ones to replace them. So head off. Oh, what's this? Stupid little general that I forgot about. Actually, you know what? I don't want you. You can leave as well so I can get something better. This unit's not actually good either, so I want that one to leave as well. Why don't you set up right along the wall? thing is, I'm looking to, um, you know, re I think I'm the one looking to reposition, right? We need to get closer to our reinforcement because de he's definitely got more troops than I do. So let's be sensible here and shorten our supply lines. And get closer to our home base and get rid of a lot of this useless crap. And what I'm gonna have to do here is probably set them for canister. 
and we're gonna shoot them as they get close. Alright, move back. We're gonna set a new line. It's gonna take a while. And then, um, once that's done, we'll see what we can do with him as he pulls forward to meet us. We're starting, the formation is starting to sh take shape. He is sending in his cavalry to attack my units on the flank. I was sending most of these units into the retreat. Let's see. Or the infantry that you can see over here. Most of it was sent to retreat. He decided to attack the Brunswick Hussars. He backfired on him. He took out the uh, howitzer crew ju just now, the one that was situated over here. So not a major loss by any means. Let's see. Have I? I've not been able to hide these guys. And he's sending light troops to deal with me. Um. We're just gonna go for broke there, aren't we? Now he's uh, stuck behind enemy lines and I am intending to charge him down. Meanwhile, my cavalry makes it attack. Um, more infantry is coming up. Alright, we made contact. The unit is being bro broken apart. As soon as it breaks, I'll order the cavalry to continue through. Oof. Yorkshire is getting torn up. Alright, we've got Highlanders. Highlanders, take position here. Do we send off his cavalry? No! Uh, they're withdrawing, actually. So he's withdrawing them on his own accord. Ah, uh, no. I was hoping to upset the um, his cavalry, or not cavalry, his cannon position. Keep blasting that. We got a light troop out of that and we upset his uh, formation, but that's about it. Not great victory there, to be said. Let's see. His, uh, yeah, his uh, cavalry got out. It means that I've got. Cavalry advantage, at least on this side. Which means that we could look about pushing. Gonna get these four units to leave. And we're gonna build up a surplus of troops in this direction. And I'm gonna put my engineer to work by placing spikes around here. I'm not sure who's gonna win this artillery duel as we're trading shot w shots with each other here oh no he's got he's got cavalry chasing after mine he's actually pulling is he pulling these troops back is it because I'm sending in so much infantry towards this flank Continuously marching away from us. I'm gonna start to follow up, follow them. Engineers enough. General to follow. Right, we've got plenty of troops hopefully coming in now, as the smaller units have been ordered to leave. It is just weaker Hussar units though, so as we move forward in this direction, we'll have to keep that in mind. 
The thing is, I'm sure he attacked with his strongest, or he, he had uh, organized his troops to have his strongest come in first in this battle. So we're going to be facing uh, weaker troops. There's a risk here. This one's definitely going to attack us in the flank because we're outflanked there. But I'm hoping that I can get some extra troops going in here. Yes, more and more guys are leaving. Horse-drawn artillery. If I can quickly move that up there, that could help us a lot. And then we've got bloody 12-pounder coming in. That's going to do good. Artillery duel is useless. It's not doing anything. I'm sure he's got that cav line cavalry coming down through here now. Ready to upset us. And he's moving this one hard to meet my cavalry because he's he's got us where he wants us. Now I'm sure 14th Regiment of Foot is going to be uh, plenty enough to actually break his 12th volunteers. There's random horsemen riding around back and forth over here. They're not sure if they want to leave or what they want to do. Causing a bit of trouble. Okay, I was going to, was going to set him in the woods. The 14th is going to meet him. We've got Highlanders coming up. We've got the horse-drawn artillery being dragged up. I want to play stakes. Guess behind. We're coming in at an angle. His cavalry is about to emerge. Right, hold. There they are. There they are. I thought that we were going to come through the woods, but that's not the case. He's tilting his unit. We lost, th we lost three, he lost three. His unit is bigger, though. I might just send the smaller cavalry unit out there. Oh, he's got another cavalry unit coming in. Thing, though, is... I've got horse-drawn artillery being dragged up for close support. What I want to do is I kind of want to just force him into square. Yeah. That makes it a lot easier target for my infantry to fire at. Right? That thick formation is also reduces his ability to fire back at us. And then horse-drawn artillery should be set to fire a canister at him. So now we will be deploying canister. Ah, oh, it's not close enough actually. So he ended up losing what? 7, 13 men. And I lost 3. Alright, canister didn't work. Fire round shot then and fire on the cavalry. You will move back. I've got the British Dragoons coming in. We know how strong they are. And I've got Highlanders. I don't know about them as I haven't used them yet. But I'm sure they're going to live up to their name. We've got another Highland unit coming in. Is. Um, Really not making much over on this side, is he? I think what I'll do is I'll pull back the entire line here, actually. I'm gonna make the um, pikes, spikes. I'm gonna set my cannons over here. Ooh, look at that. Right. You're going to start to pull back now. 
And then we go back to this side. Highlanders in position. I don't think my cannons actually do reach his troops right now. He's pulling back most of his troops. We'll set up the troops again. And continue on. Now my good cavalry unit will go there with Azaz on the side. The smaller cavalry unit will stay close behind. And then we've got Scott's unit here to support. What else do I have? I have two units of infantry coming up. Oh, he's uh, hurrying up to the wall. I'm going to get my uh, unit up here, though. The cannon unit. Gonna see about spraying him with canister while we're pulling back over here. Oh, he's uh, calling in a charge. Our men are running, sir. What unit is running? I oh, know my cannons. Damn it, he got one of them. All right, my light ca uh, cavalry over there went to shit. The Dragoons are going in, dealing with his line, and I need to hold the flank by sending in the Light Dragoons. Let's send in the General to support. Can I roll the cannons a little bit more forward to get a good shot here? And deploy. Alright, good. Do not underestimate British Dragoon Guards. You will not fire. I think he's... Oh uh, yeah, he's pulling back. He's pulling back. He realizes he's in a difficult situation. He's pulling troops forward over there. Uh, dragoon Guards will turn. The smaller cavalry unit will continue to follow. This unit's gonna get... A Canister, if we have time to fire. Okay, we've got one canister up there. Ooh, he's in trouble now. Okay. Set up. Follow, follow. He's bringing up a lot of troops here. Alright, meet them. Meet them. God save the king and all that. Alright, follow him. Upset that unit those. Okay, troops. Back on the advance. Oh, he's attacking my um, my sappers, is he? Let's keep an eye on everything. Unfortunately, it looks like my sappers. Our men are running, sir. It's going to be broken. But then I doubt his cavalry will be able to continue on to my cannons, which I'm sure he was hoping. Are you not going to form a square? Head on charge. Dangerous. But it is the 12th Regiment of Volunteers. And it is my famed Dragoons. And so, of course, they break. Right. I think he's... Um, I think he's going to have to pull back his troops right about now. Seek battle with them. Seek battle with them. Right. Seek battle with the enemy. Everywhere. Hold and fire. You will continue. Where am I going to place this? We're moving too fast. Go towards the center. 
His troops are caught out in the open. Seek battle. Seek battle, damn you. Seek battle. Am I getting caught off guard by anything? No. Not as of yet, anyways. Dragoons have passed behind his lines. Ready to strike for the center. This square is holding very well. The line peppering them. Brave Spaniards. He's pulling back so fast we can't actually keep up. Oh, Spanish troops rallying. Great Britain is going to show him what's so great about us. Oh, now the square is gone. High time to charge it. You can see, does he want to reform it? I'm sure he does. Gonna pull off. Now the Scots gonna have their chance to fire at him. My famed horse guard. Got a little bit worse for wear there. The thing is, we keep pushing on his flank. And he keeps giving round and my cavalry keeps going around soon there'll be no ground to give now maybe I'm overextending myself but who knows I need to stop him here I need to stop him so we get to shoot at him. Right, form your squares, sir. Form your squares. I'm gonna have to uh, waste some of my cavalry. Right, cannons. Hold fire. Horse drawn artillery, though. I want you to follow. Look at how close I'm getting. Our men are running first. I'm sure he's got canister ready for us. I'm gonna hold these two units. My fame dragoons are holding even with this. Someone, please! The horse guard, it's OP. Everyone know Great Britain OP, please ban. And I started off in such a bad position. Is there more troops coming in? Am I wondering? Our men are running for Oh, the famed horse guard. Finally broken. Right, drive them back to Spain. If you please, my lord. Oh, he's moving back his cannon. There's no point in us uh, stopping there, actually. All these guns need to move. Am I getting more reinforcements, am I? <laughs> well, by God, Wellington, Wellington, if I ever saw 30,000 men on a run... Should we give them an... I can't remember. Should we give them an order? Well, straight... F what should I order them? Why forward, sir? To be sure. Something the like. He's got something. Grenadiers of Guadalupe. And he's got 
troops rallying over here. And he's got the cannons rallying over there. 40th foot is ordered to charge before the enemy. You know what? March on. March on. This could be dangerous. As they could fire, similar to what happened where... Uh, oh. They did not have time. Ooh! Enemy cavalry is spotted in the flank. Just in time for my bloody horse guard to reform. And we got another light scouts there. I formed squares. Unfortunately then, we're gonna have to hold that advance. Oh, is he counter charging? I think this might be it. Otherwise he wouldn't toss his troops in such a reckless manner. So I'm guessing this is it. Right, the 40th. Not sure they will hold. And they didn't. Right, deploy here. I'm gonna need canister. He could break quite a bit here with that cavalry. Or not cavalry, with that charge. Well... You want to face the famed dragoons? I got two generals here. Right, let's see. I'm gonna have to aim this perfectly. He's doing the break. He's doing the break, sir. Canister, if you please! Oh, we broke our own unit. Not the intended result. His cavalry is behind us. He's got troops in the woods that have rallied. His famed counter charge. Right, we managed to break there, anyways. Will the Highlanders hold? Right, it trips, his trips are rallying. Suddenly everything's up for grabs. The back and forth is Our what makes the game so good. Unfortunately for him, my canister and uh, his troops being awfully tired. So unfortunately it's going to be the downfall. His counter charge, a valiant effort, definitely stopped um, me um, pushing him to the very edge of the map. Our men are running for but, um, didn't I order these guys to be limber so I could move them into action? Clearly not. His uh, cavalry is going to continue through. We're going to have to leave one unit to stop the enemy coming up our rear. But then we, the rest going to continue backtrack here. Oh, the, the bloody, bloody enemies got renewed vigor. Like, right, hold fire, damn you. I can still move you, horse drawn artillery. The line oh, hell. King's German Legion. Legends. You're walking the wrong way, you bastard. Like, right, the Grenadiers of Guadalupe. Or whatever. Grupados. Form line if you please. B 
bastard and managed to rally his troops. Where's my generals? I don't actually need both to go over there. You can stay over here. We are beginning to surround what's left here though. He's um Grenadiers, very tired. Let's see if we can't fire upon them. A little bit. Oh. The valor of the Spanish Grenadiers. Damn. That counter attack. He's going to try and slip away. Unfortunately, unfortunately for him, the time to slip has passed. Right, let's organize these troops. We're back on the offensive, boys. Cannons being brought up. All cannons to be brought up. And we do have... what's this? First Foot Guards. The Bill Browns. Right. Continue on. Forward. Ever in the... in... Uh, no. Ever in... Ever... what's it called? Now I can't think of it. <laughs> yeah, oh, <laughs> OMG. The savagery of this battle. I will at some point get the Coldstream Guard. Yes, the Coldstream Guard has arrived. Holy shit, yeah, the savagery of this battle, the back and forth. Um. It's um, incredible. His troops are a little bit all over the place. And a lot of them are actually ordered to... Looks like they're ordered to leave the field. And he's setting up around the woods here. Right. I'm going to order the troops forward. More strong artillery. Move forward. interesting it could be that it just switches now that you know his reinforcements he gets closer to his uh, you know replenish his troops and so we just turn the battle around once more something turned up over there I need my cavalry oh he he's bloody Cavalry Corps. Yeah. The battle is just going to turn around once more. Heavy cavalry formations being sighted. But at least it kind of signals the battle is over because uh, I'm getting my cold stream guard. Yeah. His cavalry is moving in. Um. It's time for us to dig in a little bit. Where's my engineers? I'm thinking we're gonna need spikes over on that side. Right, we'll weather the storm. I kind of forgot that he is uh, supposed to get more troops than me. And at this point. Here comes the two, uh, two cold stream guards. My engineers on their way. Troops digging in for the fight. We do have range to fire canister up there, apparently. If they would like to fire, 
that is. Fire close by then. Yes, yeah, we're doing a little bit. Ooh, lots and lots and lots of enemy cavalry. And suddenly I'm out of cavalry. The enemy army was um, poorly set up. Now most of his troops seem to be coming from over there. Most of the... I th he's sending away a lot of his troops this way. He's got very weak flank. He's moving in cavalry. As much as I would like to sit and hold... Oh, he's moving loads of troops around. He's going for my cannons. This little scout unit is going to be moved around. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to save you, unfortunately, little cannons. I tried to make it towards the square. Which seems unlikely at this point, right? Can I get you around just to see what they what they're gonna get when they're gonna get it? Oh, they they keep pulling back. But now they've got cavalry there, so makes it hard for me to. Um, To organize anything and as we said this video how long is that gonna be oh shit I just need the scout unit to scout out what they've got the thing is we find ourselves in a predicament here because we do no longer have any how long is this battle gonna go on for how many men are left to be thrown into the meat grinder okay so yeah we can see loads formation of Spanish troops coming in I lost tons of my guns to the point where we only have one left. And we've got a massive amount of uh, Spanish troops coming in this way. Do I, da I, do I dare cut through the line? To avoid his cavalry. Problem is, like, I could probably attack the woods, but as we see, he's got cavalry all around, and I do not have enough troops to cover everything. I got through. So I can see what he's got. He's going to protect his cannon, so he th thinks I'm going to go for them. Hopefully that is his last cannon. Because that isn't much then. I'm going to see if I can break through back to our line by going through here. Do I dare to push on him while his cavalry is going after mine? I've been spraying his line here with canister for quite a while. He's sending more and more troops around there. Oh, he's sandwiching my small little unit. How sad. Can you fire this way now so we don't shoot our own troops? 
Or actually, better yet, switch to round shot and shoot to the troops that haven't been sent to line yet. Bounce a few shots through these formations. His cavalry is on his way back. These units will be ordered here. You will be ordered to support this this push. Then because I've got more troops than he's got here, we got this one, which could act as square on his flank. Right, he's pushing back, moving back. We will follow. I think I'll get this one closer for support. You will form square. Support, support. move a little bit forward. As soon as I can, the cannons will be rolled forward. Right, roll forward. He's sending out two units to meet us. General on his way. Uh, another unit. Another general on his way. Nasty canister. Oh, he's, yeah, he's backing up for another one of those charges. We'll see how that goes. I'm not sure who's winning in the woods. We sent away one unit. The canister, once it starts to roar... Then... Uh, oh, yeah, they're moving forward now. And he's moving cavalry in. And this unit's coming in. Two support units will be moved. Form square. I'll order the canister to be fired that way. Yeah, he's uh, organizing my defeat here. Back into line, quickly, quickly now. Oh, we just shot the side of our own unit there. My general is here ready for support. Oh, this unit did uh, almost really poorly. Right, there's no way we're going to try and stand against that again. actually move this gun now. Counter charge. Our men are running, sir. Right, come back. Let's see, can I get you out of... No, you will not 
have time to move back, will you? Drop the square. Where's my general here? My general got killed in the battle over there. Our men are running for. Why are you not able to form square? Single bloody horse is unsettling you. Enough where the guards were enough to break it. But now I find myself without cannons. Our men are running. I, the unit broke, but so did his. So much for his bloody charge. We saw it coming. Unfortunately, I lost my horse-drawn artillery in the process. Fool me once, shame on me. Fool me twice. No, wait. Fool me, whatever. You know what I'm saying. The crap of my Joe Biden. I say give chase. Even the engineers are joining in. And the general rallying of her troops here. Oh shit, his cavalry is coming in. Form square. He did not like the fact that I broke his charge. Right, they're coming at us here. There's no cavalry, so I could send in the Bill Browns. Um, you're gonna be set to square protection over there. Highlanders. No point in you going to square now, since the enemy broke before. Our very eyes. Holy shit. Like, f at this point, it's almost as though fatigue will take its toll just because we're I've been playing this for what f feels like forever he's uh... he's pushing back through the woods now right, go straight through it I'm still getting infantry not a lot but still He's trying to rally most of his troops. He rallied one of them. Right, this one's coming to meet us. Oh yeah, he's uh, organizing for... Uh, to stop me. Not so much up here in the woods, though. Let's see... You will plug the gap here. And then you'll be reserve, and you can move over here. Like, continue. See if he rallies anything. It's still 50 50, so I'm sure there's still gonna be uh, Spanish reinforcements as soon as I push through the woods. He's gonna, yeah, he's, he's gonna keep falling back through here. He's gonna keep pushing until he, uh, he's gonna be forced to abandon this. Yeah, he's abandoning it. He's rallied most of these troops now, though. They held just long enough. So 
So now he's got quite the concentration of troops out on the flag. We'll continue to push through. We've been all over this map. And the same time, like, this battle is too, way too long for me to, uh, to do much of a, uh, like, replay of it. It's gonna be, like, how am I even gonna remember all the cool moves? Definitely some of the charges, for sure. We're kind of low on reserves on this side. The general probably shouldn't be part of the main line. He's able to uh, focus up another line. Without cavalry, I'm not really able to uh, keep the pushers up to the point where pushing him to extinction. And since he's got cavalry, it uh, makes it difficult for me to uh, continue the charges. But at this point, I mean, at this point, the troops are called Volunteerios Volunteerios. Double volunteers. So, I think it's quite fair to say that we have drilled down to the bottom and we've found trash. I think it's safe to say. So even though he's got the troops thing is, it's just for me to move forward to engage with them. Double volunteers. Voluntarios, voluntarios. Oh, we get another Highlander. Have I got the... Okay, so 90 second and 40 second. We're getting all the, like, elite units coming up here at the end. Oh, cavalry streaming through. You know, I tried this. Uh, very early on in the battle didn't really work out for me surprised we weren't able to shoot more of them maybe I should do what he did and I can kind of see a weak point there Oh, he's massing loads of cavalry. I'm gonna move that unit to the back. Prepare him to form square. The amount of cavalry. And it's once again the grenadiers are going in. But I don't think it's enough. And the Highlanders are holding their own. Oh, there's a break. Push through. Did he did he have a charge here? Oh yeah he did. Didn't go too well. The reserves will now be pushed in to join the fight. I've got the um, foot guards over here. Bills Brown against the double volunteers. We got two small, what about smaller companies. Oh, who's that? The light foot. Keep at it. Okay, so the Grand or the um, Highlanders did actually break there eventually. Okay, he's uh, he's in full retreat. Yeah. 
Everyone follow. It's hard to say what to do here. Um, a lot of the cavalry seem to be rallying on the side of the woods. Don't know if they've got what it takes. And this is the unit that doesn't have any... Uh, any shots left. Voluntarios, voluntarios. I'm about to shoot your Asios. General over there. General over there. Kind of hoping to <coughs> force this to surrender before they even get close to where they're going. Oh, what's this? Cannons. That could be a little bit of a game changer. Canister. To break my stomach. Let's aid them by shooting into that fight. Our men are running, sir. Both units broke. Oh. Let's not get too carried away here. And get too broken up as we uh, pursue the enemy. Got veteran regimental foot ready to plug the gap over there. You can go over there. I mean, some of these regiments f coming up after two Highlanders. Not sure. I guess he's uh, stopping here just because he needs time to set up his cannons over there oh he's got more cannons coming in someone plug the gap please here is where we have the chance to push against these two the thing is canister from all of this is going to be really nasty but it's the edge of the ver it's the very edge of the map. Oh, it's you without without anything. Join in over there. Give way a little bit so the weapons can fit in. Oh, they're giving way. And if we continues like this, I might be able to split the infantry away from these cannons over here. So you're kind of pointless right now, so... Oh, he's actually sending away that 9-pounder. You know, what are you out there? Oh, he's coming up with something. It's a more fierce unit. Royal Scots Fusiliers. We're setting up the cannons over here. We'll actually contract the line a little bit.
so that I can focus more troops where I need them. They're very tired and very haggard over here. King's German Legion. They're very small units. I'm gonna see if I can push. I'm gonna back up some of the units here. As I'm pushing this one forward into a bayonet charge. I'm ordering these to close the line. I was gonna try and get them right in between. Both broke. He's moving around. Gonna put more troops in here. Gonna see about splitting him down the middle. He's pushed so much artillery fire onto that boy right there. See if we can't get more troops through here. 33rd will lead the charge. 21st gonna follow. Our men are running for. Yep, out in the flank, but at the same time, you can see what's going on here. Where did the general go? Moving around. And I'm gonna move more and more troops into the hole that I've created. Actually, he's got troops coming in there, so you will march to meet that. Hoping to beat through here. If we can beat the straight line here, I can might be able to get at the um, at the guns. March out, see if you can meet those. He's about to break here. Ooh, nasty. Gonna be a close call right here. Twenty first. It's not very happy with its situation, is it? Oh, he's go he's gonna do another one of his charges, is he? And he's going to do something similar there, I imagine. Oh, we're bro we're breaking, yeah. Oh shit, you will hold fire. Yeah, it's not going my way here. I'm able to shoot up the cavalry on that side, that's good. Come 
Might as well get rid of the engineers. Our men are running for Would think the Black Watch. Well, he uh, he got wise and sent his troops back. We got one coming back over here. Maybe you can march around. With that cannon, it's hard to uh, because he's constantly like pushing such nasty fire into us. Oh, there they... here they go. Now they're off. It's a veteran regiment, though, they're charging into. So I wonder if it, that will work. Units break around, but the unit stands firm for now. The volunteers of Madrid oh, might actually be able to. Oh, they did break through! God damn it! It is those cheeky little charges. I'll be ordered into the retreat. Actually, get into the woods, just hide there. Still getting, <laughs> still getting reinforcements. See how that goes. There's simply too many of them. And now it's like another. Oh, he's ordering his cannons forward. I've still got some fight in me. What's he charging? All the retreating troops? Close ranks with the rest of the army. Chasing those those guys, they're not gonna come back, so I don't see that as a priority. Bye bye, you stupid cannons. Uh, right, push through. Go after the light troops. There's so many s bloody Spaniards. We never seem to. Um, this never seem to be um, an end to them. Sir, your general has been oh no! Killed. This is a black day. John Pitt died. 
charging retreating troops. That means there's one general left. He's back on his guns. The other general... Oh, the other general broke. Because of that. Because there's no general anymore. Forming square against the bayonet charge. Our men are running for. Never heard such a thing. Now both my generals are routed. I have no generals left. But the fight continues. The uh, Coldstream Guard might uh, have bitten off more than they can chew over here. Or maybe not. Maybe not. Right. There's more than one person who can charge. Entire unit is dead. Oh, he's ch he's keep charging the units out there. Well, if his cavalry is not here, then I should move my troops on the offensive. I've got so many more troops coming in. Will this fight ever end? If anyone's still watching this at this point, you, sir, are very dedicated to the craft. He hasn't deployed the guns here. Yes, you think you can stand volleys? On the cold stream guard, I think he's realized what's going on and his cavalry is now coming back. There's too many volunteers of the volunteers going on in the Spanish army. Oh yeah, he's sending in the guards of Valona to stop me going after his cannons. 48th Regiment of Foot is going in to meet it. This unit's about to break. As it does. You'll be able to move in. It's forming a very thick formation. It's going to be hard to break that. Yeah, it's too many units. At least he won't be able to form he wasn't able to form up for the canister. Our men are running, sir. 
Who's running? Oh, you're the flank. There's no pushing there anymore then. Oh, he's formed up can cannons over there now. He's center, bro. Units marching to our aid. He's winning on this side. I'm breaking the center, though. Where is he going? He's going for this side. Oh, shit! I didn't see those cannons. Shit, shit, shit. Units has used all its ammunition, sir. That is bad. Oh shit, there goes the guards. His cavalry is about to charge any second now. Form square. Literally, like a second later, he charges. I guess he might just want to kill off the uh, Coldstream guard. I still have my bloody cannons. The volunteers of the volunteers could go in. Just have gone. Screw themselves. Right, all of this right here is completely fucked. his cannons yeah he's gonna ride down the proud guard until the very end oh they're making a stand over there the Gordon Islander is gonna hold Oh no, not the Volunteers of Madrid! Oh shit, they're actually... Um, my guys had enough there. So did his! I spoke too soon, continue the charge. Oh, he's coming up behind us. Oh. Whatever that was. Got destroyed, or whatever. No, I probably don't remember you. Pull back a little bit. Oh, his cannons got destroyed. For shame. Are you cavalry is going to charge again? Oh, wait, what? Tremendous luck that they rallied there. Back into line. Back into line. Look at that. Oh, I think he's seen it. Maybe not, actually. What are you doing? It's a general. But he's dead. So you can leave. Is there anything here? No. This side is... very much 
faltering. Ooh. You can go through and get the rest of them. This line is way too drawn out. Our men are running, sir. White unit's running now. In the middle. Veteran units, we plug the gap. Right, now we're looking at the final units of our army. Because I'm literally not getting any more reinforcements. And you know what? It kind of feels good actually. I'm finally out of troops. This is it. This is it. There will be no more troops. And I mean... At this point... Oh, it's gonna crash now, is it? When it's gone on for this long. <laughs> it was time for it to crash. Oh. Damn. I wonder how long we played for. And then it crashed. Um yeah. <laughs> there we have it. I mean, it was too ambitious, really. But at the same time, look at how close we were. I was actually starting to run out of troops. Oof. Um, it would have been fantastic to take a look at the statistics of that. Just how many men were lost on both sides. But it was an insane battle back and forth. I... Th mm. The thing that bugged me is obviously I've been playing it. I would I'm playing as the AI or the AI, and as they structure their armies, were completely stupid. Um, but yeah, I wonder though, could I have beaten him even with the few troops that I had left? Could I have beaten him? I think he said it was ten thousand to sixteen thousand troops. I wonder how much of that I actually, like, worked my way through. Anyways, I've dragged, out, dragged this out way too long. At least this shows that drop-in battle works, and hopefully I'll get him to drop into some of my battles, which are way smaller, and we actually have a chance to complete that. But, yeah. As always, I'll say as I always say, hopefully you guys enjoyed it, and hopefully I'll see you guys for the next one. Bye!